Yeah, you can come on in too and we'll do the paperwork in here. Okay. Hey guys, are you excited? Are you excited? So you go by KJ? Uh-huh. Okay. Come on. There you go. They're all sneezing. Who is? Uh, all three of them. The, the other two sneezed uh, yesterday. Oh. Yeah, as long as I mean sneezing is normal, just like humans. As long as there's not any like discharge from the eyes and the nose. Mm -hmm. If you see that, they might need uh, medication, but okay. just, just sneezing is fine. Okay. And sometimes they might just like humans have like little stuff in their eyes, but yeah. if it's like constant discharge and stuff coming out the nose, that's no good. Okay. Hi, animal. You're so excited. Have you thought of names? Uh. Probably Sebastian. Yeah. She wants to call him Sebastian. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Trevor, or, um, I'm decided right now, but we'll probably just call him Trevor. Right oh, okay. Hey, Trevor. Okay, so here's the, yeah. the, table, the um, adoption agreements for them. Mm -hmm. Do you mind actually sitting more here or, or there? Either way, okay. just the cameras there, and I know they like to watch the kittens yeah. right before they're going to leave to their home. Okay. <laughs> so the contract pretty much look the same, but you'll need to sign both of them. But it has the name of the cat, this is their microchip number. Mm -hmm. So microchip is implanted here, and if they were ever to get lost or end up in the shelter, if they're scanned, it would lead them back to you and to kitten rescue. Okay. So we'll put all your information on there. Um, and then their birthday, Trevor was September 6th, and she's, and the uh, animal, sorry, is August 22nd. <laughs> and then um, here's my contact information if you need to get a hold of me and you of course already have it mm -hmm. they always eat the contract <laughs> <laughs> and here's their when they were tested given their dewormers flea medication vaccines uh -huh. when they were neutered it's all right here so when you do bring them to the vet eventually you just bring this and they put all this information into their database to okay. know when the next vaccines are due okay yeah so then you would just you'd read all these and initial and then sign here okay it basically just says you'll keep them inside you mm -hmm. won't ever declaw them mm -hmm. uh, and that the most important one is if anything were ever to happen you can't keep them they have to come back to kitten rescue mm -hmm. not to the shelter and don't just give them away and okay contact us and we will take care of them okay So all of these right here, I need to show it, right? Yeah. Okay. Can you just smack <laughs> Any more? Come. Come here. Undressing me? good strings are always a hit. <laughs> yeah, I came in here with uh, stringy sweaters. Yeah. She has a home. 
she's going on Saturday. Oh, she is? Yeah. Do they already have another kitten? They have a two-year-old cat. Oh. It's playful. Ouch. That looks kind of like an animal. Getting anything done from now on. <laughs> <laughs> the cat ate my homework. <laughs> and uh, did they need the rabies vaccine? Um, we don't give it. That's sometimes recommended, but really it's better not to give it because the cats are indoors. Uh, yeah. This one is the same one, just initial. All the one. But it says the same stuff, so you can just initial. Okay. Um, yeah, vets like to sell as many vaccines as possible, but um, for an indoor cat, there's no way they could get rabies. Uh -huh. They have to be bitten by a, an animal with rabies, and uh -huh. in LA, there's not even, not even the skunks and raccoons have rabies in LA, so. Yeah, what about the possums? You, won't, you wouldn't let a raccoon into your apartment anyways. No. <laughs> um, the, yeah, the possums don't either, and not in LA. Uh -huh. Overall, possums pretty much never have uh, rabies. They're very resistant to all diseases. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to let it go. <laughs> Thank you. No. No. And then I'll show you real quick. Uh, let's see. Medicate it's a little different medicating a kitten than an adult cat. It's way easier with a kitten. So the easiest way to do it is to just scruff them like that gently and pull them up a little bit, and then you just do that. Okay. In right through the side of the mouth and just okay. put them, pull them up on their hind legs. Okay. You don't do that with adults, but it's easy on kittens. Uh huh. And then, do you know how to cut their claws? Uh, no. No? Okay, I'll show you both. I've already cut their claws. Okay. So, it's easiest to be two people, but you want to make sure it's like as positive an experience as possible so that mm -hmm. when they're adults, they're easy to do. Like, mm -hmm. you can give them treats and stuff. He loves temptations. Oh, okay. You know the temptation treats? Yeah. He goes nuts. <laughs> okay. he, do he doesn't really care, but he loves them, so. When you cut their claws, you can give some treats and stuff. Okay. So the, the easiest thing to do is if one person kind of scruff gently and just like hold him in their mm -hmm. lap, and then the other person can hold, you hold under the paw pad with this finger, this one you push here on the claw, on the, mm -hmm. on the toe, so that the nail comes out and then you clip. Just the very tip of it. Okay. As you can see that there's, I don't know if you can see, but there's pink stuff inside. Yeah. Yeah, so that you never you want to cut wanna, that because yeah. that will bleed like mm -hmm. crazy. So you yeah. just you just cut the sharp part and just make sure not to cut down to the pink. Okay. Uh, no filing needs to be done. No. Okay. No, you just get one of these. They're like a few dollars at Petco. Yeah, we have one already. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's okay. it. I'll get the carrier. Okay. That's good. She looked really big on the camera. Or is she a little tiny? Little tiny food. Trevor. Hi, little baby. Are you really trying to bite it? Anyways. Come on. Come on, Trevor. Come down. Aaron really likes her home. You should take a picture for her. Thank you. 
So fluffy. Oh, you know when you put this in Japanese, it switches the last, so it's last name first name. And switched it. He's so good. He hides it. He hit his collar. I don't know if he's possible. Oh, my gosh. I'm send him with a blanket, too. So I'll just put your in both the blanket and the carrier. OK. You're working. Yeah. Working on Sunday, right? Yeah. Okay. I can return to that. Mm. bringing uh, new kittens in here? Um, we haven't quite decided yet because Lulu is staying here till Saturday. Uh -huh. Better move over so the campiers can see. Who's the little Can white one um, with blue eyes? Is that Anthony? No, that's Anthony's sister, which I don't remember what her name is. Yeah. Uh, Anthony is the brother of the gray and white. Uh-huh. Okay. Chloe. Cle Chloe. No, Cleo. Cleopatra. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's just really cute. I saw her, um, I think, last week. Yeah, she's cute. She's still real little. Yeah. You got the wrong cat. <laughs> nice. Well, it should be easy taking the Lulu home. <laughs> so let's hop right in there. <laughs> Off today? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Spent some time with them. Oh, good. Gonna be as 
cooperative, are you? Nope. <laughs> Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lilia. Lilia. them in like one room mm -hmm. uh, let them get used to that make sure they're eating and using the litter box so that they know where the litter box is because kittens are so small their bladders are really small if they're in another room and they don't know where the litter box is they'll just go oh, okay. <laughs> wherever they want to go so yeah make sure start them in this space where the litter box is make sure they've gone a few times make sure they've eaten mm -hmm. and then um, and then you can start letting them out a little more mm -hmm. It's usually best, I know people don't like to do this, they want the kittens out right away. It's best to usually do like two days of just a small space. And yeah. Okay. And see what they seem comfortable with. Okay. Lily, really, say bye bye. <laughs> she wants to play. She wants to play, yeah. It's a fun, it's a fun toy. What's he doing? Caught at me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Alright, guys. I hope Lulu's not too lonely. Nah. Be a little lonely, but we have volunteers coming in and she's good at entertaining herself. That's we cool. might we might bring in a friend for her in a couple of days. Oh, okay. To keep her company till Saturday. Yeah, that would be good. Probably, yeah. We won't let her be all on her lo alone all to Saturday. That's too long for a kitten to be sitting all by themselves. <laughs> uh -huh. So. Alright. Bye bye, brothers. Oh, <laughs> that's cute. <laughs> Do you want me to bring the papers? Oh yeah, I can bring those out. Yeah.